Hi guys. Uh, today I'm going to show you uh, a, a warning message which I'm getting when, when I'm trying to install VMware tool. Okay. When I'm trying to install this VMware tool in uh, my uh, virtual PC, Windows 7, I'm getting this uh, message. Due to this uh, uh, warning message, I cannot uh, complete the VMware tool installation. So you you are, you are know that we need the VMware uh, tool for uh, many reasons. So if you don't have VMware tool installed in your client PC, you don't have many uh, functionalities such as copying uh, files from your uh, host PC to uh, uh, the virtual PC and your state resolution and so on, so many things. So we need to install this one somehow. So uh, this is one of uh, uh, warning message. If I click OK, there's another warning message I'm get. So there are two warning messages. So this is second warning message. So let me show you how to solve this issue uh, very easily. Okay. First, uh, cancel the installation or exit from this uh, installation somehow. Okay, finish. So first, uh, you have to copy this uh, link. I will put in my description area. Okay, copy and open a for a web browser, anything, Google or um, Edge or anything, just paste and download the file. Okay, it will open the, my mega uh, online uh, drive and you will see there are two uh, zip files, okay. This one of uh, win, uh, Windows 7 x64 bit another one windows 7 x86 okay there these are uh, small update files not big uh, files these are like 62 mb and the 64 bit another one 38 mb the 32 uh, bit so first you have to check in your virtual pc what is your operating system is it uh, 64 bit or 32 bit if you are system 64 bit, you should download the 64 bit uh, update file. If your operating system is 32 bit, you suppose you should download the 32 bit. So in my case, this is uh, 64 bit. Okay, so I'm going to download the 64 bit one. Okay, here I go download. You can see I will go. Just click uh, the download. So once I click download, you will see here the file will download. Okay, the file is downloaded. I'll open the file location. This is a file. Uh, this is a zip file. I need to extract. Once I extracted, uh, open the folder, and you can see now there are two uh, update files. These two files you have to copy or whatever you should bring inside this client PC. I don't know in your case how you will do. You have to bring. Uh, since I don't have a VMware tool installed, I cannot click and drag. You know, I cannot drop here. I cannot copy. I cannot copy and paste. Those functions are disabled, not working. You must install. So there are another option. You can open your uh, Windows Explorer. You can download from here itself if you want. Uh, so you have to uh, type manually this uh, web link here, and you can open. It. So in my case, my internet is very slow inside my client PC, so I cannot. So what I do, uh, what I can do now, very easy thing, uh, I will access from here, from here, uh, my uh, shared folder of my uh, uh, 
my real PC, my PC, okay, original PC. So what I do, I will uh, copy this folder, or I will cut. Uh, I will go to C drive, okay. This is my original, uh, I mean my, my real PC, okay, my host PC. This is my host PC, okay. Uh, this is the virtual PC. In my host PC, I will make a folder. Any name, any name you can put. I will put one, two, three. Okay, and right click, go to properties, go to sharing, go to share, and click this one on the drop down and select everyone at at the user and share. Okay, and done. Closed and open the file folders and paste the both files okay so these are the both files okay you can see these are the files now these both files are inside folder one two three which were we was share okay so what i do uh i will access from here this folder now you have two uh ways to access this folder but one way you have to find out your PC, uh, PC name, okay. For that one, you have to go uh, Windows uh, settings, uh, go to systems, go above. You will see your device name, okay. You can type this device name, you can access, okay. You can go to your uh, virtual PC. I think black slash mm, folder name one two three. Uh, okay, you have to put uh, two more slash. Sorry, not double single slash. Yeah, it will take some time. Yeah, uh, here you must uh, enter your uh, username and password. Username and password of your host PC. This PC, you know, this one, your real PC, username and password, which you are currently logging, that username and password. If you don't have password, I think you have to set up a password in your host name, otherwise this cannot login will not success. You must have password. In case some PCs, they don't have password because maybe they are using personal, they just have uh, to log, uh, come to login screen, just click the username, that's it. But if you don't have, I think you will need to uh, make a password in order to uh, access from here. Okay. Uh, you can try it. Uh, if not, you have to make a password. Okay. So I will enter here my host PC password and username. Okay. Okay, now uh, the folder is open. You can see uh, this is a folder where we uh, where I kept the both file and inside uh, Windows Seven Sixty Four. So this is the both files. You can copy here, paste in your uh, Windows Seven uh, Virtual PC Desktop. Okay, guys, this is the command. You have to put to backslash. And your computer name and one backslash here, okay, and your folder name, okay. Then it will uh, open directly the, the folder, okay. Here two backslash and computer name, and here single one slash, and this is our folder name, okay. It will take some time depending on your network speed to open the file and uh, files, so you have to uh, be patient, okay. Now, what we do, we will install. You can install this package first and second this one. You can either you can install this one first and second answer. No problem. Anything you can do. Yes. No, there's no order to install.
guys, once the once the both uh, packages are installed, you can restart your PC. Then you may try to install again VMware tool, and uh, I I believe it will be success. Okay, guys, thank you very much, and you may keep watching this video if you want. I will uh, go ahead, and if you already uh, watched this video until this moment, no problem. You can uh, do uh, try the VMware tool. Okay, don't restart now. Um, you have another pack, uh, package. You have installed this one, then you can restart all of it. Okay, guys, both packages installed. I will delete this one. I don't want anymore. This both. Uh, I will do restart. Okay, guys, the installation is done. Now you will try to install VMware tool. Okay, guys, there's no any error. The installation is success. So, thank you very much for watching my channel, guys. Thank you.